postpartum depression, right? Okay. Does how does this you know play into everything we're talking about? Um, because that is something from obviously physiological from having a baby, and then does that come from the part of the Bible in Genesis where it says the pain of pregnancy comes from the fall in the garden? <laughs> well, that, we need a woman to answer this question. Maybe I don't know, but uh, let's go to the man's punishment. He might he will work by the sweat of his brow. brow yeah, right. So there's a lot of. Uh, I'll answer this one, I guess, and you guys can chime in. But there's a lot of things that not just men and and women working in general, right? Yeah. The way uh, that we work to get ahead, but we don't feel like we're ever ahead. The way that you know. Uh, time seems to run out on us. I think there's a lot of things that can flow from that, what God said, well, you're going to work by the sweat of your brow now. Mm -hmm. I think a lot of things can flow from that. So in the same way, maybe the pain in childbearing could not just mean the pain in the actual, and you you guys can correct me or whatever, uh, chime in, but not just the actual delivery process, right? But maybe afterwards. So what do you think? Yeah, I I think that uh, women are incredible. (laughs) <laughs> and, uh, well, he's a genius. Yeah. yeah, I should have started uh, with that one. Yeah. I love my wife. <laughs> yes, me too. <laughs> Good point. Yeah, um, I think that if the roles were sort of reversed and men had to go through childbirth, I think there'd be a lot less people on this planet. <laughs> yeah, that's you right. know? Like that's fact. Yeah, I would not want to have any babies. <laughs> um, it, this is a great question to directly answer. Uh, number one, um, postpartum depression is a real thing. There's a, yeah. It's a physiologic response. Uh, if you think about the incredible trauma that happens to a woman's body in enduring nine months of basically having a parasite, and I'm saying that like, I'm saying that with the respect, a very simple respect of energy it's versus demand. It's resources inside your body. Yeah, absolutely <laughs> taking priority of your physiologic processes in every organ system. Including your brain. It takes like half a brain to make a placenta. That's what I heard. Right? We had that's a lady on staff says. that was pregnant. She kept saying baby brain. And I'm like, that's not a real thing. And she's like, yes, it is. And so I Googled it and I was like, oh my gosh. Yeah. yeah. It's a thing. The, the, the hormonal environment dramatically changes, but also at the end of that nine month period, uh, they are tasked with pull, uh, pushing a bowling ball through a mouse hole that happens to be in a very sensitive area. So there's that. So it's an incredibly traumatic process. Um, I do not think that postpartum depression is a punishment as a result yeah. of the fall of sin, because if, if so, it would be universal, right? Everybody, every woman would have it. Yeah. However, we see an incidence of postpartum depression of, of about uh, somewhere between 10 and 15%. Mm-hmm. It can be a little bit higher in impoverished communities, uh, likely because of the impact of the woman not being in the workforce and contributing to income. That's just hmm. sort of that's my, uh, that's just sort yeah. of my, my assessment on that. But yeah. um, it's a real legit trauma that happens to the body. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's why uh, most places will have women be off for at least 30 or 40 days. But really I think there's good physiologic recovery from that trauma at about day 30 to day 40. Uh, but for some women it's, uh, it's more than that. Yeah. And that's provided everything goes well. If things don't go well, which there's lots of things that can potentially not go well in the whole birthing process, um, that, you know, that uh, correlates with longer recovery, you know, um, getting back to grassroots common sense, uh, disease treatment processes. If you're if you're struggling with this, get help. Yeah. Talk to an expert. Mm-hmm. You know, uh, there's a legitimate physiologic explanation for it, and therefore there's a legit physiologic treatment. Yeah, yeah, that's good. I think Thank for you. this one, we can say, like you said, yeah. there's a legit physiological yeah, uh, yeah. Pro- uh, issue yeah. going. And I really on. like the point yeah. you said that if it was punishment, mm-hmm. then every woman would get it. Yeah, and, that's true. You know, yeah. That, I never thought of it that way. Yeah, and that then good. you see the why in the question yeah, that right. we need to get away from. Right. Yeah. Why is this happening? Is it yep. because God's punishing the Focus woman? Focus on the who, not the why. So it's just, okay, it just happens. Yeah, so, yeah. exactly. So.